Hello everyone. This is the ninth question of exercise 5.1 and we are given a figure and these six parts are given to us. So the first part says that is angle 1 adjacent to angle 2. Now basically I tell you that adjacent angles are those angles which lie on each other side. But there is one more thing to know that adjacent angles are those angles which have one common vertex, one common side and they should not overlap each other. Now in this case you can see that angle 1 and angle 2 have this common side, this is C, common vertex O and they are not overlapping. So that's why they are adjacent angles. Now in part 2, angle AOC and angle AOE. AOC and AOE. In this, you can see that AO is the common side, O is the common vertex. But these two angles are overlapping each other because AOC is this angle and AOE is this complete angle. Now because they are overlapping each other, this means that they are not adjacent angles. So this means they are not adjacent angles. In the third part says that angle COE and angle EOD form linear pair. So yes, because you can see that COE and EOD, these two angles lie on a straight line. EOD is this angle, CO is angle 2. So these two lie on a straight line, that's why they are linear pair. So yes, they are linear pair. Now, angle BOD, BOD and angle DOA are supplementary, DOA. Now you can see that this is a straight line. This means that angle 4 plus angle 5 will be equals to 180 degrees. And you know that supplementary angle makes sum of 180 degrees. So this means that yes, they are supplementary angle. Now we have to tell is angle 1, angle one vertically opposite to angle 2. Now these two lines are intersecting at this common point O and these two angles are opposite to each other. Yes, they are vertically opposite to each other. And in the last part, what is the vertically opposite angle of angle 5? So this means that these two lines are intersecting. This is the common point. So angle 5 will be equals to angle 2 plus angle 3. Because this complete angle, angle 2 plus angle 3 lies in front of angle 5. So vertically opposite of angle 5 is angle 2 plus angle 3. So this is how you can solve this question. For any queries or doubts, you can contact us through our YouTube channel or through our website that is www.trumas.com. Thank you.